In this demonstration, I'm going to introduce you to the new PMI for sheet metal. So we've introduced a sheet metal label command right on the home tab. And if we launch that there, we can see that we can introduce a label or a PMI label for sheet metal bend features and also the body features. Before we go there, let's just close the dialog here and set our model view for the the labels that we're going to introduce and I'm going to put these on the back view and I'm going to create my bend I select the bend and I can generate the PMI I can do the same for the body base so I just pick anywhere on the body and these attachment leader points can of course be uh, put into different locations so I can pick a point on the surface say I want to put that here and we can generate the, the PMI uh, as we see fit. Now, if we look at some of the options that are available in these PMIs, we can go to the settings on the dialog here and we've got this new sheet metal header and there's two things we can do here for, well, for these. We can change the number of decimal places of the, of the numbers and for bends, we can decide what parameters I want to see. I can turn these on and off and have what I would like to see there. I can also rename the prefix, say for neutral factor, I want to say K, for example, and we can configure those uh, on the fly. Similarly, I can do the same for the body base PMI. And again, we've got the sheet metal tab. I can change the number of decimal places where appropriate. And I can choose what information is actually added to the PMI along with changing the prefix for each one of these. If we look at PMI preferences, we can also see we've got the sheet metal tab here with the same options. We've got body, we've got band, and we can set these up with the settings that are required by default. So just to show the integration here, I'm just going to delete those here and go to my top view. And we can see that I've got some sheet metal PMI labels added, integrated nicely with the other PMI. And these can all be pushed out to a technical data package or used downstream in other ways. And finally, if we look at the MBD Navigator, we can actually see all of those sheet metal bend labels uh, alongside the dimensions are stored there within the Navigator. And that's PMI for sheet metal in this latest release of NX.